Hey guys, I'm in Vegas and I'm at Star Nursery and I'm about to hit up a whole bunch of nurseries today and I want to show you guys what all they have and see if they have anything cool and I'm going to buy a bunch of stuff and mail it back to myself. So, come with me. Hi there kitty, are you friendly? Aww. I miss my pups at home. Hi there sweet kitty. Alright guys, let's go find the succulents. Okay, so let's take a look around. These aren't the succulents, but um, here's some cool stuff. Oh, here's some um, Sansevieria snake plants. And, okay, here's the prayer plants. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, oh, I love these starfish. Look at these, these are cute. Oh, and they've got braided ones. These are $3.98. Oh my gosh. Okay, I already have some of these, so I'm going to try to control myself. All right, let's keep looking. You guys, this place is really big. So, someone just pointed me way over here to the succulents. I think I see, I think I see some agaves way over there. Hmm, smells so good in here. Let's see. All right. Anything I buy, I have to ship home to myself, so I can't get any of this big stuff, but, oh wow. Look at these huge cactuses. This is a saguaro. This thing is big. Okay, all right. Here we have some Indian fig cactuses, cacti, century plant, bunny ears. Here's some centuries, some more bunny ears, prickly pears. Oh, this is the purple prickly pear. I have one of these at home. So I'm going to try to be good. Oh, but that one is really beautiful. Okay, all right, I'm gonna keep looking. Oh my, oh my, oh my. Okay, I should not have come here, but I'm glad I did. All right, let's keep looking. Okay guys, look at these bizarre ice plants. They are really thick. Like, way thicker than the ones I have. Okay. Here's some more I, uh, desert ice. Okay, I think I found the tiny succulents. Here's one. Here's some more ice plants. Ice plants here. And then we've got strings of bananas. Little assorted cacti. Okay. This is where I want to be, right here. Succulent special, two fifty for a four inch, two dollars for the little, littler ones. Oh, there's some big ones. Okay, so I'm going to take a look through these. Oh, lots of vegetables, and you guys know those are my favorite. All right, I'm going to take a look through these, and when I'm done, I will post or I will find a good I'll take a picture of what I got but I have to look now so one more view oh there's a pretty sun okay that's really cute okay all right I'll be back these two dollar afterglows and I'm gonna get these two dollar um aeoniums and then this one I don't know what it is but I had to show you the guys this real quick look at these gigantic echeverias I mean these things are like a foot long I mean big I had to show you guys these like I have one of these at home it's a xantha rose but look at it oh my goodness okay they're huge beautiful they've got shavianas neon breakers xantha rose oh they've got everything they've got fred ives over here I don't even know what this one is right here but look at it looks kind of like a blue heron um sure is big though but anyway all right i'm gonna go check out because i have so many more places to go but i wanted to show you guys what i got so here's what i'm getting two aeoniums two afterglows and this oh and by the way they have a big pot of string of pearls four dollars so but i kill them all so i'm not gonna do it okay I'll update you with the next place. Bye-bye. Okay, guys. So, I'm finally leaving Star Nursery. I got this one. Don't know what it is. And I got these guys. And 
my total was $12, so that's way better than where I was. So anyway, off to the next place. Bye-bye. Escape that I'm driving around. Is this not cool? It's just desert and mountains everywhere. I know there's geodes out there. Okay guys, now I'm here at Cactus Joe's, so let's look and see what they have. So I drove all the way around the desert. You guys check this out. Look at the background of this place. Mountains. Well, I can't zoom in. Oh, well, I'm literally out in the desert, you guys. So let's go see what they have. Great. Really cool stuff already. Why don't we have places like this here, or where I live? Okay. All right, already love the place. Hello. You guys, this is crazy. There are pieces of glass and cacti everywhere. And I don't really even want to video because there's so many things to look at. Oh my gosh. Um, look at this. Okay. First off, I see a giant agave here. So you guys know I need to come get next to this guy. I wish I could flip this around. It's big. Okay. What else? Oh, goodness. Okay. There are just rows and rows so i'm going to turn this off and look around and i'll be back they're just cacti everywhere oh my gosh okay there's something i want to show you before we go into the gift shop you ready oh my goodness guys this is real through. Wow. And I haven't even made it halfway through this place yet, but wanted to show you. Okay. I just checked out the gift shop, but I thought this was neat. You guys, I don't know what this means. I think it's a maze of some sort. Um, but anyway, um, the gift shop had a whole bunch of different, um, minerals and, and rocks and geodes. And, uh, looks like here's a bunch of, um, it says it's chalcedony, but it looks, I don't know. Um, there are geodes you can break open yourself. All these rocks are $5 per pound, and it looks like they just have a little bit of everything. Okay, here's a bunch of obsidian. Oh, no, midnight, yeah, midnight lace obsidian. Okay, I knew that's what it was. Yeah, they just have everything here. This is only the second place I've been to, and I'm glad I rented the car for two days because... I could stay, I could spend all day here. Okay, let's look at a few more of these rocks and then I've got to turn this off or this video is going to be an hour. Okay, now we're finally in some shade and I can see, this is just, I guess they just go out in the desert and just find things. Okay, here's a geo that, there's so many cool things here. I don't know if I ever told you guys, but I'm also a rock and crystal collector, so in case you're wondering why I'm spending so much time here. Okay, that's neat. I hope I don't run into anything here. Well, as soon as I say that, okay, I'm going to make my final purchases and get out of here. And here's one last overview. Really cool Cactus Joe's, love it. And there's way more over there that I didn't even go into, but I've got to keep moving or I'm never going to make it to even half the places that I said I was going to go to. And finally, here is the giant, uh, not this, but I took a picture with this one earlier, huge cactus. Okay. 
let's go to our next destination and i don't know where that is yet talk to you in a minute okay finally made it out of cactus joe's i didn't think i was ever going to get out of there because it was too much um but anyway i bought two geodes and i got them to take a cutting of the giant black aeonian they had so this is my haul from there, and I will put that in with the rest of my haul, but this place is really cool. Anyone who is out here in the Las Vegas area, if you love cacti, you could spend all day in here. It's very, very big. So anyway, let's throw these in the car, and oh goodness, I've got a rental car right now, so. I actually have to use a key. So here's my second haul. So I've only been to two places and look at me, you guys. So let's move on to our next place. See you soon. Okay, you guys, I am headed to my third plant place here in Las Vegas. I went to Star Nursery and I went to Cactus Joe's and now um, as you are about to see I am hitting up another Star Nursery. Um, this is kind of like a chain here so um, I don't know um, but I'm hoping maybe that they have different things at the different ones so I don't know, I found uh, two afterglows at the other one for only, what was it, two dollars. So anyway, we're going to go in and I will show you what we have in this one. So see you in a minute. Okay, Star Nursery again. So here's the beginning of the outdoor section and now we're going to go look for the succulents. So let's see. Um, hmm. Oh, I think I see a clearance rack, but I don't know. Okay, I've already spotted the succulents. Um, I think once you buy them so often, you just are drawn to them. So, looks like these um, big ones are, these huge echeverias are $7.00. The medium sized ones are four and the little ones are two. So I'm gonna look through these guys, but let's see, I'm seeing a lot of things I know. This one's really pretty. I like the roughly ones, you know. Um, this one's pretty cool. None of these are labeled, or actually only a few of them are labeled. Um, sometimes when they're labeled, they just say um, just assorted, so. Anyway, here's some of the pretty big ones, and then I'm going to take a look through these, and I'll come back and let you know what I got. So, there's a giant Aeonium, some Xantharos, Topsy Turvies, and the regular guys, but, um, okay, might have a few good finds, like at that last place I found the, uh, the two afterglows so i'm gonna look around and i'll be back bye bye okay guys so they have you carry around a wagon um to get your stuff but anyway here's my haul so okay echeveria lipstick or i mean agavoides lipstick and uh guess who's got a pop all right i don't know what this frilly one is um but I had to get it anyway. Um, this interesting Aeonium, it looks like a kiwi or a pinwheel, but it's got some variegation on it. Um, I'm sorry, but I had to get another afterglow because they're just so cheap here. Um, and then I got two other things. Oh, they let me have these uh, black prints and jelly beans on the ground. Okay, this was, this was $3.98 and I just thought it was cute. So I got this. All right, and then this, my friends, is a Culebra for four dollars so anyways now I have two of them so I am going to load this stuff up and get back on my mission so see you soon hey guys I decided to stop at a Home Depot just to see if they have anything different than the ones that um, that we have back home 
and they certainly do so they've got some of these um crested eaves needles uh, those are 20 bucks um what do we get here uh, brush or torch cactus there's some euphorbia lots of agaves they're only 20 bucks here um i really want one but this is probably too much to pack because you know i'm putting all my stuff together and just packing it into a box and I'm gonna mail it home. So I kinda gotta be picky, but um, here's some of the succulents. I'm looking around. Do I see anything that is out of the ordinary? Not yet, but these have some really good coloring on them. Um, they're just regular old, uh, are they? No, no, they're sedum. Um, Heck, you file them? Okay, I thought they were different. I have a bunch of this aloe at home. I'm trying not to break this thing. Um, let's see. I will let you know what all I find, but it looks like about the same kind of variety as back home. Um, so I will, oh, there's a, a cool agave. Okay, so anyway, I'll get my stuff if I get anything here and let you know what I got. Okay. Home Depot, but check these out. Okay, these are huge Echeveria. These, this one's called Blue, or no, that's a Pachyveria, but it sure does look like a, a rosette. But anyway, it's called Blue Toad. Look how big these are. All right, there's Blue Toads here. They're $16.98. We've got Lilac Mists here. Um, lots of them in a pot. Here's another Blue Toad. And then these are um, Purple Pearl really big. I really want to take one of these home. I mean, look at this leaf. Side of my hand. Um, really want to take one home, but I can't. And then we've got these rufflies with the little bumps. Oh my gosh, I'm really debating getting one of these because you never find these with the bumps. And check this out. Okay, so these are Violacina. Oh my goodness. I know a certain someone who would go crazy over these this just thing is just huge. Look at that. There's a little leaf. Maybe there's room in my box for one big one. And it may just have to be this beautiful one. Uh, what are these? Are these still, these are still Violacina. Yeah, they are. Um, oh, man. Oh, I have had the best day. Oh, check these check that out oh they're all over the place just gotta look for them a little bit all right well i want to show you guys this and there's lots of agaves they have a much larger section than what we have um so had to show you these though because these are the biggest ones i've ever seen so all right i'm gonna go check out and debate on whether i should get one of these and then i'm out of here Okay guys, super sorry if you hear any beeping, but here's the things I got from Home Depot. So this is a Graptovaria Amethorum. It's kind of cool, we don't have those at home. And then there's a little prop lift leaf. Um, this is called Drunkard's Dream. Uh, I've never seen something quite like it. And there were other ones that didn't look quite as good or full, but they're kind of orangey like fire sticks. So I got these guys. And then this was really pretty. These are some painted ladies, um, Derenbergii. So anyway, okay, gonna load them in the car and go to the next place. Bye bye. So at this point, I realize it's getting ridiculous, but this was my plan to go around and look at more places. So we are at yet another star nursery. And after this, we're going to Moon Valley Nurseries. So. I'll let you know what I get in here. Bye. Guys, this is inside one of the star nurseries. And we've got some cool stuff right here. Some jelly beans, neon breakers, cola donuts, um, candy cane crassula. And then we have this cute little koi pond right here. And we've got some little friends that are lazing. Um, Sometime I need to show you guys a video of my four water turtles that I have had since 2001, so they're 18 years old. But anyway, um, I want to show you guys this and also what I found. Um, 
This is some sort of tiny two inch, $2 succulent. I was gonna say it's raindrops, but this one's kind of funny looking. And let me check it really well for mealybugs. Um, I know you see that little stuff on there. And they're not moving, so I've kind of inspected it, but I'll probably isolate it. And then I found this laying on the ground, so I'm gonna ask them if they'll give me this piece of paper spine cactus. So anyway, um, that's the only thing I found at this one, but I'm gonna move on to the next one in just a second. Okay. Well guys, I made a pit stop um, right next door because I saw a shop that was um, exotic birds. So I went and looked at some parrots. Um, I used to have a parrot and I lost him a couple years ago um, to cancer. But anyway, um, now I'm at Moon Valley Nurseries and this place is a lot bigger than I thought. So let's go find the succulents. Here we go. There's some giant um, century plants here and there's also some parrots in there. And I wanted to show you guys these. Look how big these guys are. Um, these are taller than me. Of course, I'm only five feet tall, but anyway, um, they didn't have a ton of little ones, but here are some giant, um, some giant cacti and let's see, I haven't looked over. Oh, here's some more small ones. I didn't even see these, so. Oh my goodness, look at this guy. Interesting. They actually have quite a few bird cages here. So here's some more, um, here's some agaves and aloe, of course. Oh, these little sedums are so cute. And I hate when these guys fall out like this. Um, but I don't see anything here that I don't already have. So we're gonna look. Oh, okay, that's a dove. Um, we're gonna look over here. Okay, I have a tiny coral aloe, but look at this thing. It's huge. Soap aloe? Okay, I've never heard of this. It looks like a regular aloe. Um, here's a bunch of sedums. And, oh, these are, um, these are really interesting. I've seen these at a bunch of places. The little fuzzy... What are they? Propeller plants or crushula? Um, I've got all these guys. There's some agave, Queen Victoria. I do want one of those. Um, I don't want to pay $70 for one, but uh, there's a kitty who apparently roams the, the grounds. Um, okay, here's some I have not seen yet, but I'm seeing a lot of blue curls. Large succulents here, $5.99. Um, oh, well, there's a there's a coral owl right there. And, oh, there's another cat. Okay, there are animals all over the place here. So I was wondering what this thing was because I have one of these lady slipper cactus. Okay, I have one of these at home, but it's small and I didn't know what it was. So, anyway, I'm gonna look around here and this bird just honked at me. Um, but anyway, I'm going to look around here and I'll let you know what I get. Okay. Okay, so kind of cool at Moon Valley Nurseries. They have a lot of parrots and they also have a toucan. Maybe that will focus. Oh. And they have turtles and there's cats. So anyway, um, oh, and they have two big Galapagos turtles. I wasn't going to go to any more plant places today and then I said I was going to go to Walmart and pick up some stuff um, for our hotel room and then what was right next door to Walmart? Well, a Lowe's. So I checked out Home Depot so I figured I need to give Lowe's a chance. So I'm going to go there and check the stuff out and then I'm serious I'm going to go get my stuff from Walmart and go back to the hotel room because I've been gone all day, and I'm sure Hubby is... No, he's not bored. He's with people. But anyway, let's see what they got. Okay, so sorry about change of scenery, but I wanted to go ahead and get the stuff from Walmart and get back. But this is the stuff I ended up getting from Lowe's. And these four um, at the bottom, these were all 50 cents. Um, so this is a, um, a Debbie. Uh, it's the Graptovaria Debbie. 
Um, and it doesn't look too bad. And all these will recover. Um, I think this could be Sidavaria Blue Elf, or I don't know what it is, but it's not, it's not labeled. Um, this is a chroma, um, looking a little sad. And then, uh, Moonstone's right here. Um, I did pay $4 for this, but that's because there's two. It's a variegated agave, or two variegated agaves. And then I got this little can. Um, these were all on clearance. They were $3. Um, and it's just got three little half dead things, but I thought the can was cute. And, um, so anyway, so this is my haul from Lowe's and then I will show you one more picture of everything and then hopefully I can put the whole video together. So give me one second to line everything up and we'll be good to go. Okay. Final clip. Um, Sorry about my stuff in the background, but this was, this was the only place in my um, room that I could find where to set everything. So anyway, this is my haul from today. So um, as you can see, I got my Agavoides lipstick. This is the drunken, uh, what do they call that? Drunkard something. Um, Amethorum, a Calibra, some sort of Aeonium with some variegation. Um, there's the Starfish Sansevieria. Um, this was a cutting someone gave me. And other cuttings, I got a Paper Spine, Purple, Opuntia. Um, this thing, Propeller maybe, and then, um, a Black Aeonium. Got two Sunburst Aeoniums. This roughly Echeveria. Three... Um, afterglows, and they were all $2 each, so were these guys. Um, this weird thing, which I think, I thought was a raindrops, but, like, some of those don't really look like raindrops, but it still may be. Um, Derenbergii Painted Lady, Chroma, Debbie, Moonstones, uh, Unknown, maybe Blue, a set of very Blue Elf, two Agaves, and this sad, uh, can of something, but... Um, overall, I'm super happy, and I still have my car tomorrow, so who knows what might happen. I may need to go make a run because I marked down, um, like 12 or 14 places, I can't remember, and I think I hit six or seven, so anyway, um, hope you like this video. There may be a part two, and if there is, then just keep tuned to my channel, and I hope you guys can subscribe. And also hit the bell notification. Um, that'll let you guys know when I make new videos and upload them. Um, but please keep in touch because I will show you updates of some of these. You know, because some of them look kind of sad. Like, this one looks sad on the top. But you guys just give me a little bit of time. You know I can take care of them. Um, so anyway, hope you guys are having a great day. And I hope you can subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.